Hello guys, in this video I will talk about list in LaTeX. There are three environments that you can use to create a list. The first one is itemize, which creates an unordered list. And the second one enumerate, which creates an ordered list. And lastly, description environment creates a list of description. Let's start with some examples. Recall that to be able to use an environment, we should use begin comments. Okay, here it is. Then we are writing our environment name itemize and for each item we will use item comment. Here uh, you can see that I highlighted on the left and also you can see a bullet point uh, at right. So this is first item and let's say this is second item. Basically we are using uh, item comment so that we can uh, create items. And uh, let's add another one, third item. And if you want to change uh, a label, item label of a single item, you just need to open uh, square brackets, which is an optional argument. As you see, it's now empty for the second item. And for example, let's say question mark. And it will be a question mark here. And also for the third one, let's use, for example, diamond. Okay, so these changes are only for that specific the corresponding item. This is how we use itemize environments. And the enumerate environment is not that different. Again, we are using begin comment with uh, enumerate. And again, we are using item comment to create each item. Okay, let's say second item and third item. So, the only difference is that, as you see, the environment, uh, uh, the enumerate environment creates ordered list. It has order as one, two, and three. And again, you can uh, modify the specific item label. Right, let's make it diamond again. And the second item label will be diamond. Okay. As you see. And the counter just uh, goes on like it was three before we added diamond but it's now two it just continues Let's... and lastly the description environment let's create a description environment it's our, it's our begin comment and we will use item again and first item second item and uh, item okay so as you see there is no label item label for this description also they are uh, more left aligned so the left margin is smaller but it has an optional argument here for example we can edit an item and you will see in front of the second item the label it labels as an item and for the last one let's use another item so basically you are listing uh, descriptions for example if the name of the description is an item then this is the description of that uh, item this can be very helpful when you uh, want to describe a bunch of things and lastly let's focus on the nested list so to create a nested list, for example, we will create an itemize. Uh, this is first level. And to, to create a second level, we are creating an, another itemize environment within the uh, current itemize environment. And let me make it the new page so we can easily see the whole picture. Okay. So here it is. This is first level. This is second level. And let's me copy and paste. This is third level. It should have been here. This is fourth level. Okay. As you can see, each level has different item labels. 
The first one is palette, the second one is dash, and the third one aesthetics, and the last one is center dash, center dot. And we can also try to add the fifth level, but it won't work because itemized environment can have at most uh, four levels. I just want to show it here. Here, as you can see, there is a LaTeX error. It says it's too deeply nested because the maximum depth or maximum level is four. So as you can see, it just appeared as fourth level uh, item because it has a dot and you can also understand from the alignment. We can also do the same for uh, enumerate. So let's copy and let's paste this. Okay, it will give an error, but we will be fine when I'm done with pasting. Okay. So uh, again, we have an error for the fifth level, but here how it looks like. Okay, if I create another item here, let's say first level, second item, and you will see that it will appear as two, and these are one. And the first level has a number, and the second level has a letter, etc. Okay, so this is how we create nested loops and nested list. And also you can use uh, itemize and enumerate together, which is also possible. For example, you can start with enumerate uh, first table, enumerate, and then you can create, okay, itemize it first table, itemize. Okay, so let me another list so you can see which list uh, I am talking about. Say another item. Okay, these nest loops can be very healthy. Uh, I think that's all for this video. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope that it was helpful. Please leave a comment if you have any question. Hope to see you in the next videos.